Alright, so you are playing a really awesome character. How did you approach this? How did you I mean how did you like get into this into the mindset and into the whole the whole thing? How did it happen for you? I think, um, of course, I read the comics and uh, did a little bit of research on, you know, samurais and uh, Japanese samurai films and everything. But my main source came from training. David uh, let us go through a month and a half of pre-production, where we went through rehearsals and training with all of the cast members. And I think that helped out a lot because for me, I didn't know how to wield a sword and I had to be a samurai warrior. So knowing that from the core and knowing my choreography and uh, everything from my muscle memory, I think that helped in developing Katana. Now, Katana, she even though she's in Suicide Squad and she's technically bad, she's actually kind of, she can go both ways because she's, in, she's been in like Birds of Prey and been around. Yeah. So are we going to feel more of the good side from Katana in this as well? Maybe some hints at that? Or is she just coming off purely as kind of the bad guy? No, no. I actually don't think Katana is purely evil at all. She has a moral code and uh, she's very loyal to Flag and Waller. And uh, she's a little bit different from the other characters in that sense. But um, she's deadly, let me say that. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have any experiences that really stick out the most from filming? I'm sure there's a bunch, but is there one that's kind of kind of sticks? You're like, I will always remember this Suicide Squad moment. Oh, there are so many. I see. There I think so I many. I knew I'd catch uh, you at that one. Okay. Um, Just give me one. There's got to be one. I right know now, one. right now, I think um, uh, we all went to uh, Oshiaga. Oshiega? Oshiaga? It's a music festival in Montreal and uh, we spent three days there just hanging out and uh, we weren't filming or anything so we really got to enjoy each other's company and uh, I think that was probably one of my favorite memories. Did you get a squad tattoo as well? Did you for real? It's on your leg or you have it hidden? Oh my goodness. So did everybody? I do. <laughs> So Margot actually did it? Yes. We, like we legit? We really folded jewels and uh, one of the assistants did chives and we all did each other's. Um, but Margot did mine and... Oh wow. That is legit. Yeah. That's it's awesome. Fading on the, uh, you should never get it touched up though. No, Just we are it. getting it touched up. You uh, are? When press comes around this summer, we're trying to uh, bring her gun, and then we're just going to... Do it, do it in the press line, like right here? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. We're going to be like, five minutes. <laughs> we need five minutes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, the movie looks awesome. I'm excited for it. I think everybody's excited for it, and I wish you the best of luck with it. Can't wait to see it. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, thank you for having me.